Hi guys, it's Elizabeth here and I wanted to share a quick video of my travel journal kit that I'm using this summer. I tend to move back and forth quite a bit uh, in and out of the house and I also have a trip, uh, several trips coming up this summer. So in order to keep things nice and portable and simple to carry around, I've pared my supplies down to just some bare minimum and I wanted to share that with you today. So first you'll notice that there is this bag, it's the one with a little strap. It's a bag that comes um, for reading books. So if you, they come in various sizes. There's a small, medium, and large made for paperbacks all the way to big hard covers. And I used to use them all the time, but I don't so much anymore since I'm pretty much using uh, eBooks. So I travel everywhere with my Nook. So I tend to not to use these bags so much for reading material anymore. But Take a look at your supplies. You'd be surprised what you have that you can repurpose for some other um, fun activity. So this one, this particular one is made by Book Gear and it's got a couple of zippers. So if I open up the main compartment, so it's got a couple of pockets in the front and in the back. So this is the journal that I'm using this summer. I, you will, if you take a look at my YouTube channel, you'll see that there are various journals I go through, uh, different ones in different years. I go larger, I go smaller, I go handmade ones, um, you know, all over the map. But this summer, I'm trying to keep things simple. I decided on making it spiral bound. And this one is the Strathmore Mixed Media. Let's see if you can see that. It's the mixed media paper. It's the five and a half by eight and a half inches, and it's spiral bound. So it actually works really great. Supplies I show in the back. It works really great because because the paper is really heavy. It, it takes all sorts of material really nicely. It takes um, inks. It takes color pencils. It takes watercolors. Let me do a quick flip so you can kind of see some of the stuff that I have in here already. And um, and it has and the other thing is it has lots of paper, right? So the other thing that I do with this journal is, as usual, I tend to go ahead and pre prepare some of them so that when I come to that page, I'll do something with it. But anyway, nice and simple. This is the only journal art journal that I'm traveling around with this summer. I do sketches. I do just some doodling. Whatever I'm doing, it's going to go into this book. Okay. Now the materials the art supplies I'm carrying along with me in this book let me just zip that up so you can see it all fits in there there's a pocket in the front and in this pocket this is basically what I have okay so I'm carrying along a koi watercolor pocket field sketchbook so I love the colors in this one. I've got various um, palettes that I tend to use, and you can see that in some of my other travel journals, uh, videos that I've made. But this particular one has got some fun colors, and it's easy to move, to use, and, you know, it doesn't take up that much room. I always have a couple of black pens. In this case, it's a Faber-Castell and a Micron. I use a water brush. And this one, I think, came from some company's uh, travel supplies or uh, sample kits. It's a little spray bottle. So all I do is I basically put some water in there, close it up, and then I can pre-moisten my palette so my ink, uh, my paints are ready for me when I'm ready to go. So that's essentially all I'm traveling with this summer is this um, Strathmore book. And I'm staying with the smaller five and a half by eight and a half size, the Sakura Field, a pocket field sketchbook, a couple of pens, a water brush, and a mister. That's it. Easy peasy. I'm always ready to do a quick sketch, to play with some colors, and we'll see how the summer goes. So my my goal is to finish this this summer. See if I can get the entire uh, 40 sheets of this done this summer. We'll see how that goes. So that's what I'm currently traveling with. Nice and simple, easy and light. I'd be curious to hear what you guys are doing for the summer in terms of travel journaling or sketch journaling. What supplies are you using? 
And how do you carry them around? How do you make sure that you always have something in your bag that's nice and light and doesn't weigh you down? I would love to hear any thoughts and comments. Thanks for watching. Talk to you soon. Bye.